I don't know. Well, what would I have to do? Well, you'd be one of the stars. But what would I have to do? It's a terrific role. He's handsome, suave, debonair. But what do I have to do? Oh, well, you know, memorize some lines and say them. It's really fun. Please? Yeah! yeah. Please! <laughs> oh, hi, everybody. I, uh... Whoa! <laughs> You're all there. Strawberry? She's at the cafe, making lunch for the rehearsal. Every member of the cast and crew gets a catered lunch and dinner. Mm -hmm. So, what do you think? Well, uh, if you really want me to. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Huck. I'll email a script. See you as soon as you can get here. Okay. We have a Prince Berry Charming! <laughs> but, but, everyone in the land is invited to the first ball of the season. Why, why can't I go? Why, you have nothing fitting to wear. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> but couldn't I borrow something of yours? Oh, the idea! Sister, do you hear her? Our vile stepsister has the nerve to demand one of my frocks. <laughs> oh, now I shall never dance with Prince Very Charming. I... Oh, muffin crumbs. That's not in the script. No, I spilled. Speak not such nonsensical buffoonery. <laughs> oh, hi, Huck. No, I didn't mean you. We're rehearsing the play. Great, I'll tell them. No, we're at the cafe, getting dinner for the cast and crew. We'll be at the theater in two, no, three minutes. Excellent, see you there. Oh, and thanks again, Huck. I can't tell you what this means to us. You're a real prince. <laughs> He's ten minutes from town. Oh, it's so great he wanted to do it. Oh, he couldn't wait. Of course, the idea of having your lunches and dinners is what sealed the deal. <laughs> <sighs> I think that's everything. Shall we get this show on the road? Charming doesn't show up soon. This whole production's gonna turn into a pumpkin. I've saved dinner for Huck. Whenever he gets here. Didn't he say he was... Yeah. Said he was ten minutes away. That was hours ago. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> Finally. Oh, he's very charming. Okay. May I present our very own Prince Barry Charming. <laughs> oh, that's... 
No, really, I, uh... Thanks, but... I'm so sorry. I was almost here and realized I had left this script you emailed me at home. Had to turn all the way around, go all the way back, and... Well, I thought you'd all be asleep by now. We were. And dreaming of our Prince Barry Charming. Hey, well, <laughs> Charming, that's me, I guess. Hmm. The play's great. Nice writing, Blueberry. Thank you, Huck. Coming from a great writer like you, I'm... Well, thank you. And I've been practicing my lines. I, uh... Hi, Raspberry. What? Taking your measurements. <clears throat> Taking your measurements. For your costume? And so the impatient princesses, Lemonella and Rasbelina, asked the king and queen if they had come to a decision. <laughs> huh? Who, who are you? What? <laughs> well, what you waiting for? Have you decided to give the kingdom to me, or what? <gasps> Is that any way to speak to your royal parents? Uh, whatever. Hmm. How should we speak anyway? Good afternoon, your majesties. Like your sister, Princess Strawberrita. She's always so respectful. She cheats at croquet. Yes, that's right, she sure does. <gasps> now, princesses, your mother and I have made a decision. <sighs> it's about time. Give me that crown. Do you mind? <clears throat> Our decision is this. <clears throat> Whichever one of you can bring us back the Royal Goldenberry will be awarded the kingdom. What? Royal Golden Who? Uh, well, I never... Better get started. It's a long and challenging journey to find the Royal Goldenberry. <gasps> well, what are you waiting for? Go fetch me that berry. Don't listen to her. Go fetch me the berry. The berry is mine, so mine it must be. Perhaps you weren't listening, my dear daughters. You must fetch the royal golden berry yourselves. You each may bring only one berry kin in waiting with you. <sighs> you! That's right, you! <coughs> Step lively, you're coming with me! Yes, your highness. That's your royal highness to you, buster! Um, yep, sure thing. Anything to say, your your high royalness, royal highness? You there! Let's get going! Excuse me, your royal highness. I'd be happy to help you find the royal goldenberry, but you might not want me, because everyone knows <laughs> I'm the littlest barrican. Littlest Barrican, I would be honored if you would help me. <gasps> Hello? Oh! Excuse me. No, excuse me. Uh, who, wh where'd you come from? Berry Bitty City. I'm Strawberry Shortcake. I live there with my friends. Oh, hi there. I'm Huckleberry Pie. Hello, I'm Orange. Hi, I'm Cherry. Hello, Huckleberry. I'm Blueberry. Ed. Ah, <laughs> uh, Merle. Where are you headed? Not anywhere now. I'm kind of stuck. Hmm. Not for long, you aren't. Yeah! Woohoo! Guests behave. 
You're so lucky to have so many pets. Oh, Lemon, they aren't mine. Whose are they? Well, uh, nobody's. <gasps> so you've been driving from town to town in Huck's Pupmobile getting dogs adopted. Yeah, I started with 25. I'm taking these, uh, leftover guys to Berry Big City to start Huckleberry's Home for Pets. Aww. That is quite admirable. Eh, uh, Mr. Huckleberry? Uh -huh. uh, Mr. Huckleberry, you're good to go. All fixed up. Thank you so much. And thank you, Strawberry, Cherry, and your friends, too. <sighs> well, I'd better head out. But it's late. You might get lost again in the dark. You can stay upstairs here, and I'll stay in my other room above my cafe. Well, that's really nice of you, Strawberry. <laughs> Looks like they feel right at home. Well, I hope you do, too. Oops! <laughs> Almost forgot my guys! Dinner? Uh, is this part of my bedsheet? Oh, Strawberry, I give up. This is so embarrassing. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I fell asleep and they stayed awake. I guess you could say they, uh... Redecorated? It's what pups do. Strawberry, you've been so kind. And then this. I insist on fixing your room. That might take some time. However long it takes, I promise I'll put it back the way it was. That's very honorable of you. You're welcome to stay as long as it takes, then. Never let each other 